David Fridman, who has produced albums most notably for Flaming Lips, Mercury Rev, he produced The Woods. And I'm very curious, how did he come on board for this? Uh, I actually have been a big fan of Dave's for years, and I saw him speak at this thing called the Tape Op Conference in Portland, Oregon. Uh, it's about recording and mostly like home recording. And uh, I just thought he was a rebellious, really cool guy, and the few things he said um, about like miking the headphone mix and uh, you know, like these sort of uh, you know, non conformist ways of recording really struck me. And I think when we were going to choose someone, we're like, let's get that guy. <laughs> and do you think this whole process going in the woods and doing things differently saved Sleeler Kenny? Slay Sleeper? Okay, you. Uh, <laughs> Certainly. <laughs> yes, <it is. laughs> uh, well, I think that in as we were approaching the songwriting for this record and just approaching the idea of, of making a seventh record, we did feel like we had nothing to lose and that we wanted to go beyond ourselves and step outside of the comfort zone that we had grown accustomed to. So I think it just was part of that whole journey was to go somewhere where there was going to be a lack of safety and a lack of familiarity and to get to a place that was dark and kind of strange for us. I think it allowed us to almost reveal more of ourselves than we have on some other records because we were, we did feel kind of out of place but it almost sort of opened things up more.